ハローハローヘローハローかーはーいはいヘローはいヘイヘロー<笑>はいハローイドイハロー That was a very hesitant huddle. I don't, I don't know. The connection's a bit iffy, so I don't even know if you guys can actually hear me or not. So, we coming out here. Welcome to the jam stalls. Let's jam, 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 jam. Let's go. Ah, thank you. Hi, everyone. Hi. It's me again. Broca's hands. Hi. I missed you. I missed you. <laughs> the alien hands. The black hands. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ah. How are you all doing today? Hmm. It's been less than 24 hours. Less, wait, what? Less than 24 hours? What do you mean by that? Oh, thingies. Thingies. You think my hands are small? All right, okay. Question. Um, do you think my fingers are short Um, for my hands or long or medium? Do you think I have long fingers or not? Because I don't, I don't really think I do, but I think my hands are, are very balanced, actually. I think my hands are actually very balanced. It looks very average. Mm. I kind of, I kind of wish, I kind of wish I had longer fingers. I think it would make it a lot easier to play certain instruments. Mm. Medium, but you have nice wrist. Nice wrist? Well, it makes my wrist nice. <laughs> well, it makes it a nice wrist. I actually do not like my wrists at all. I don't know. Do you feel like they're going to snap anytime soon? Also, my tendons are really clear. Ah, like you see. I don't really like that. It's, it's kind of creepy. It's kind of creepy. Some people say it's it's kind of gross. Oh, long fingers are weird though. I don't care about how it looks. I care about usefulness. That's what matters most. Hey, can you guys hear me properly? Actually, am I loud enough? Oh, I feel like I'm not loud enough for some reason. And I okay, I can see. I see why it is. Give me a second. My audio interface reset it. Um, ignore that sound. Do a little bit, a little bit more. Something like that. Something like that is a bit better. No, it, it reset it for some weird reason. Um, so I had to reopen it. Ding. All right. Yo. Hey. Hi. I'm back. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Did you find it? Did you find out my little surprise for you today? Hmm? Did you find out? <laughs> huh? People found it. They found it. It took you way too long. I was expecting someone to find out about it, like, almost immediately and it it took you way 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 too long which like why did it take you that long hmm why did it take you so long huh you found it out of course of course you were too slow it was way too slow okay you were busy today why are you not checking my emotes 24 <laughs> 24 7 huh? you should be checking it all the time you should be f5ing all the time on it all the time all the time all the time all the time hmm if you guys miss out on the next one i'm going to post mm, you're gonna get it you're gonna get it mm. okay <laughs> okay not a member of my bed okay that is a valid excuse but all those all those green all those greens mm. No, 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 you can't do that. You can't do that. Uh-uh-uh-uh-uh-uh. Uh-uh-uh-uh-uh. It is unacceptable. Sorry for the jump scare again. <laughs> I didn't know this was a call of hell. <laughs> what? Huh? For your loco. Did she show up? No. Hey, what happened? What if I want... To be purple, you want to be purple. I wish you could change your colors. Actually, I wish you could change the colors in the in the chat for that. I mean, you can only be pink. The purple ones are the ones with no no memberships. Hmm. What about green people? Green people. <laughs> wait, green people. Did, wait, wait, wait. Green, green people. Aliens. Is Fuyo actually an alien? Guess I'll cancel my someone membership. No! I'm crying. I'm crying. 
I'm crying. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, today, um, I'm not eating anything yet, but we will be eating crazy, weird food combos that I found on the internet and also that she sent to me. And, um, I am kind of. I'm a little worried about it. <laughs> Because I hope my tummy is going to handle this Because some of these seemed fine And some of these seemed absolutely kind of like Absolutely disgusting to me Like I'm actually worried like if that will go together Um, are you gonna swallow? Of course <laughs> That is the rule You're only allowed to swallow We, we don't do spitting <laughs> We don't do spitting <laughs> Okay Lid jaw be fine. I mean, it's okay. The only thing I'd worry for, um, worry about for my jaw would probably be the croutons because they're a bit crispy. Um, which we, I'm going to do that. That was a suggestion that suggestion that was made by my gem mate, uh, Coney Confetti. She suggested I eat a vanilla ice cream with Italian croutons on it, which sounds kind of interesting actually I, I i i can kind of see that work out but i don't know i'm gonna rate it i'm gonna rate it on a scale to uh from one to ten um one being like absolutely nasty and ten being like you know what this this slaps this is fucking delicious um so um i read a little bit through some of your suggestions and i gotta say some of the suggestions were actually better than some stuff that i came up with so, um, there would be quite a lot of suggest of your suggestions on this list, but, 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 sadly, I couldn't do some of them because, um, it was impossible for me to get some of the ingredients. Like, I think someone mentioned something like cheese, cheese whip, cheese, cheese whiz, I don't know, wh whatever it was. We don't have that here. It's some sort of, like, spray cheese or whatever, or, like, squishy cheese sauce we don't have that here we don't even have anything similar to that also stuff like um what is it so like cheerios or um what is it pop pop tarts pop tarts now i'm a pop tart but that i'm the only pop tart here um we don't have that here either and you can get it but it's it's you have to go to like a special store for it like an expat store whatever the fuck they call it <laughs> So, no, no cheese whiz. We don't have cheese whiz. Do you, ha do you guys have it over there, actually? Hmm. It's like whipped cream from a can, but cheese instead. It actually sounds really good. And when I am going to uh, Morika, um, I am probably going to do a stream about that while I'm there. Um, I plan to actually stream while I'm there. I'm not sure if it works out or, or not. Okay, okay. I have to look into if this actually works out or not. But, like, I want to I wanna stream while I'm there as well. Um, because I don't want to take off. Um, and I want to keep streaming. And I want to try all the Moroccan food and all the weird stuff like, like cheese whiz. Plastic cheese. <laughs> and fun with awful American internet. Is it that bad? It tastes like rubber. Ru isn't it supposed to be a sauce? How does it taste like rubber? Is it like latex or something then? Latex? Latex. Morocco. Depends on where you are. What is what is the state with the best internet? And what's the state with the worst internet? I'm curious now. <laughs> Don't get a heart attack. It's so gross. <sighs> you just make me want to try it. I remember being absolutely addicted to this one. Um, what is it? It was this one cheese sauce that they used to have... Um, at the 7-Eleven. We don't have 7-Elevens over here, but we we have 7-Elevens in um, Indonesia. Um, and I used to go there, and I, I fell in love with it. It was it was like free flow, like whenever you bought a something, anything um, from the store, you could get that cheese sauce. So I would literally put it on everything that I bought there. It started off with hot dogs and burgers, and then slowly I started to put it inside of my ramen my sandwiches, my salads, and um, at some point I was there with a bunch of friends and I lost a bet and I had to put it inside of a, um, what you call that, like a slushy. I had to put it inside of a slushy, and it wasn't even that bad, I don't know, <laughs> it wasn't that bad. <laughs> it's, it's really good, yeah, yeah. oh fuck, I forgot, your money. I, forgot about, I forgot about this shit, wait, let me, let me change that, let me change that, give me a second. Thank you. Okay, there. 
No, 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 no South Park alerts. Sorry. I can easily flip it out now. No, no, no <laughs> South Park alerts. No. That's for, that's for the next South Park streams. I have something to look forward to. That was just me teasing. Yeah, I, d I did it on purpose. I did not, no. <laughs> I want you to look forward to something. Oi, 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 oi. Oh, but Shiki, thank you so much. A bit late, but if you do this again, you should try Battery Acid Udon. It's Sour Patch Twists plus energy drink served in a bowl. Shit. Oh, God. Thank I would have totally tried out. <laughs> no more South Park. No more. No more South Park. Okay, no South Park. Only normal alerts. No South Park. Um. So, okay, without further ado, we should get to the food. And some of these have like common ingredients so i kind of made it into groups so um it's easier to try um but um let's see maybe we should first just start with um the one on the thumbnail what do you guys think <laughs> i'm not sure if you saw this th the thumbnail so the thumbnail had a picture of um cheetos Cheetos and milk. <laughs> it, was, it was Cheetos and milk, and I found I found that. And um, I was so so so. It's not just. I, I was thinking maybe I can try both Cheetos and milk, and also uh, Doritos in milk. Which one do you think would be worse, Cheetos and milk or Doritos and milk? It will. It's kind of like. It's kind of. Uh, like cereal, it's kind of like cereal. It's like so cursed. I, I, I find it kind of fascinating how people they they see that and they're like, oh no! But when I saw it, I, it wasn't even like it doesn't even look that gross to me. I don't know. I feel like for me, chocolate stuff turns me off more. Whenever I see like chocolate on on savory dishes, it's like, Ugh. I don't know. With Doritos, with Cool Ranch. Um, we don't have Cool Ranch over here. It's called Cool American, and um. The cheese, the, the, sorry, the Doritos that I have are nacho cheese flavored. Cause the texture that sounds pretty good. Okay, there was one problem though, and that is that I could actually not find the original Cheetos over Thank here. Thank you. But I found this. It's um like wait, let me just open it. Up. <sighs> cool American. It's cool American flavor. <laughs> It is like cheese poops. So I, I, I have the feeling this is actually going to be worse because I feel like this is going to absorb the milk and probably turn in, into like a slurry the instant it hits any sort of moisture. I feel like the, the original um, Cheetos, um, oh my God, look at the dust on my, on my gloves already. <laughs> Damn it, it's gonna get super soggy. I feel like the original cheetos would have probably stayed a bit crispier, but I couldn't find them anywhere. They only had these cheese puffs. I don't even know why. So I feel like this is going to be nastier. So maybe that's funnier. I don't know. Um, <laughs> pass the controller, bro. Just pass it to me. It's okay. I'll wash my hands. Wait, I'll wash my hands. <laughs> Your controller's already broken, so coated in cheese dust. Should I do it? <laughs> Should I do it? I'll do it at the end of the stream. If you remind me of it, I'll 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 coat it in cheese dust, and um, I'll coat it in cheese dust and bury it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. So we'll start with we're so, we'll start off with this one. So mm -hmm. there you go. I'm not gonna make like giant portions for obvious reasons. So um, let's just. Put floor. <laughs> I just put floor in because I'm a little scary. Ah, they look like worms on the screen. <laughs> then I feel like a mad scientist now. And then some milk. I'm going with um not whole milk. Uh, I usually don't go for whole milk. Would you love them if they were worms? No, I'll hate them. All right. Uh, is my milk so good even? <laughs> I don't know. I don't actually know. That's not, it smells good. It smells good. All right, I'm pour pour some milk in. All right, here we go. Mmm, that is going to be scrumptious. Mmm, <laughs> look at that. It doesn't even look that bad. Come on, it's just 
white and orange. Like, it doesn't even look that nasty. Look at it. <laughs> Let me just eat it quick before they turn absolutely soggy. Um, wait, where's my spoon? All right, let's go. Let's go. Gotta, gotta get it with some milk. All right. <sighs> Itadakimasu! Describe it as a snowbitch food critic. I'll I'll try. I'll try to describe it in great detail so you don't have to eat it. Thank you. That is just weird. <laughs> I don't I don't know. That is just weird. That is well, So it's still crunchy in the middle. The outside, however, as said, instantly got soggy. I feel like the milk washes away the Cheeto dust. So you don't really get that cheesy kick that you usually get when you eat cheese puffs. Um, and instead, it kind of mixes with the milk and makes this ever so slightly salty milk, which is actually not too good, if I may be honest. <laughs> and, um... Oh. My god. So... It's like... Salty, like slightly salty milk with this soggy Cheeto in it. And... I would not rate it like super bad either. It's not nasty. Let's keep five as like an I can eat this, but it's not it's not gross. I would put this as a maybe maybe a four and a half to five. Four and a four and a half to five out of ten. Why do I you didn't even tell me like I didn't Ah like Cheetos in milk. Ah, there you go. Um Cheetos in milk. Cheetos in milk are does it taste like salty coins and milk, though? <laughs> no, it doesn't. I don't know what it tastes like, okay? Um, no, no. 4, 4.5 out of 10. Um, I don't know. It's it's just kind of weird. It's it's It doesn't really mix well. It doesn't really mix well. I feel like the longer it stays in the milk, the worse it gets. It's already worse now. It's slowly going down. It's a 4 out of 10 now. I also absolutely hate how like there's like tiny crevices where the salt just stays like on it and then you have like these tiny salt bombs while you're eating it so there's like no flavor at all and then all of a sudden you get hit by this salt bomb i don't know well i'm already at the entire stream okay i'm just gonna leave it inside let's see if it like swells up by the end of the stream all right <sighs> let's see uh, next one next one next one so um I saw this one, um, cereal with OJ. With OJ. Ah! And I'm kind of scared for this one. I've seen pictures. Uh, let me just not drop everything. Pictures of this before. What kind of cereal though? Okay, so actually the normal cereal was sold out. So I only I could only find Frosted Flakes, which is like the closest I could get to like normal cereal. Um, so those are the Frosted Flakes. <laughs> those are the Frosted Flakes. OG and Frosted Flakes diabetes in a bowl. I mean, the OG is this. I actually got a good OG. I got a good OJ and it's like a freshly, freshly pressed one. Um, and I don't think it has like added sugars to this. No, it has no added sugars to this. So this is pure OJ. Um, but the cereal, however, is definitely very, very sugary. Um, it has pulp. It is, this is a very pure one. I, I don't really like the OJs that are made from like just, um, like a constant, concentrate, concentrate. I don't know. Um, this one is like freshly pressed. 
Spirit OJ doesn't sound so bad. I have the feeling that actually the fact that there are frosted flakes is going to make it a bit better. I feel like it's gonna be really nasty if it wasn't. Oh god. I shook it and there is a fucking pulp on it. Wait. Okay, orange juice. Oh gee. Jesus, why was all the pulp on the top? Did you see that? That was just... <laughs> Like a, a massive like oh my god it's all it's all, it all went to the top i shook it and just all came out like that so now it's it's look it's just all the pulp <laughs> it's just all the pulp well oh well it is what it is i guess <laughs> that was just all the fucking pulp in it oh god <sighs> okay <sighs> there you go Let's, let's actually smell it. I didn't even smell the other one. It smells like OJ. I do not smell the cereal, obviously. I don't think cereal has much of a smell anyway, so... Yeah. Itadakimasu! <laughs> Itadakimasu! Let's go. Oh god, there's so much pulp in this. This is just OJ pulp. <laughs> OJ pulp with cereal. Let's go. Let's see if they're still crunchy. Yo! This is good. <laughs> it's actually good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. The frosted flakes do help. I think if this, if this wasn't frosted flakes, it would have been kind of meh. It's actually pretty good. It doesn't feel like a, like a, like a meal anymore, though. I feel like a... What is it? Just cereal with milk feels like, a, like an actual meal. Like a breakfast. This tastes like... Like a dessert. This tastes like a dessert, and it's actually it's actually pretty good. It's actually pretty good. I'm I'm surprised. <laughs> I'm really surprised. <laughs> it's not for me in the fact that it's very sweet though. I don't think I could eat too much of this, but this this feels like a dessert. Mm. Mm. The frost does wash wash away, like it dissolves in the in the orange juice. Hmm. Have you eaten all or most of the crack goods, Rokum? Not yet, actually. I was thinking of like maybe finding another recipe and then topping them with the crack as some sort of furry kaka. Hmm. It's fine for OJ. Yeah, actually, it's not like the like I think this like the milk with like the salt in it was kind of nasty. Um, but this is actually pretty good. It is heckin' sweet though. Damn. I'm trying to think it reminds me of something. Um I don't know why. It has no creamy aspect whatsoever to it, but it reminds me of those orange ice creams. Maybe it's like the what is it? The sweet the sweetness of the cereal and then that acidity from the orange juice getting together and me being able to like distinctly distinctively taste both of them. Um, at the same time in my mouth. Mm. I think I would rate this cereal with OJ. Uh, sherbet. <laughs> kind of, kind of like a sherbet. Strange enough. Split, Aisha. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Split, split. Uh, we call it like that here. But it, without the creaminess. Like, so there's like a distinct sweet and sour thing going on. Um, I would rate this a... It's hard. Do we, okay. Do you do you want do you want the Roca score or do you want me to be somewhat trying to be objective? Because I feel like I'm I can bias this really badly because I do not like sweets. But I don't think this is disgusting. You know, like I wouldn't eat this. So I I, I don't know. <laughs> I think for me I would not eat this. Um, I would put it out of five. But I think how I would guess it would be put for like. Mm, Without me being biased about sweets, um, raise a normal person who doesn't hate sweets. Are you saying that normal people? <laughs> and I'm not normal. <laughs> Are you saying I'm not normal for not liking sweets? <laughs> okay, whatever, whatever. <laughs> who the fuck hates sweets? People who actually like healthy food. Okay, people like healthy food. Um, 
I would rate this a seven and a half. Seven and a half out of 10. You know what, should we, should we put a list? I think I kinda wanna put a list on, um, on the screen for this. Don't I just... Give me a second. Where is it? It doesn't show up. Center to the screen, damn it. Um, try to center to screen. Okay, there it is. Let's put it here. Um, where should we put it here? Maybe. <laughs> no, it will block. It'll block things. Let's just put it here. Whatever. Um, so we had our um Cheetos with milk. Wait, Wilk. <laughs> with milk. Cheetos with milk was, was it 4.5 out of 10? And then um, cereal with OG is 7.5 out of 10. There. <laughs> Wilk. There you go. Mm. Did I just write Creel instead of cereal? Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> Cereal, there. <laughs> Milk is water and milk. Oh no. <laughs> this sounds really bad, actually. I wonder how that would taste. <clears throat> ESL, yeah. Great Americans never make typos, right? <laughs> you like Creole. <laughs> I'm just gonna call it Creole now. Even soaked. It still tastes pretty good. Mm. All right, next. The next one um, is cheese puffs. With peanut butter. So I just got a cheese puff. I'll just go for, maybe I'll, I'll go for two. But I had to have two, two, one. Creel killer. <laughs> <laughs> Two cheese puffs. I love that crunchy sound from the bag. I could do that all fucking day long. And then, oh. Ah! Peanut butter. That doesn't sound too bad. I am not sure. I actually think this sounds nastier than with milk. But that might be me. I'm From my experience, like cursed foods with peanut butter tend to be a bit more off-putting for me because of the texture of the peanut butter rather than... Um, the taste. I don't know. Um, you want to eat with me? Well, you can. <laughs> Let me know what you think. How about you rate you rate them at the same time? If you have any, <laughs> if you have any of these foods, go get them. Rate them at the same time. I'm kind of curious what you would think. I wonder if I like if I'm very generous with my ratings or not. It's more chunky. I have chunky peanut butter because I love my peanut butter chunky. Um, most with most things, I like stuff like pulp or chunkiness or okay wait damn <laughs> damn okay 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 let's go look at it look at it wow it this is a really good peanut butter by the way i really like this one let's go a gamer snack it does kind of feel like a gamer snack this feels like a weird ass party snack for some reason okay Takimas. I forgot why it was so. Oh. Oh. Mm. That is very big text. This is. <clears throat> It's not disgusting, but I do kind of hate it. I don't know. <laughs> it's not disgusting, but I kind of hate it. I don't know. I don't know what it is. It's like one of those, you know, when you eat one of those things, um, text needs to be bigger. Oh, okay, whoa. <laughs> um, 
No, that's literally me. Thanks, I hate it. Okay, how I would describe the flavor is like the initial reaction that it gives me is like, oh, it's not that bad. But I do know that if I well, if I eat more of this, I'll probably throw up. Like, <laughs> I'll probably throw up. I don't know. It's. I feel like that's the thing with peanut butter. It feels very heavy. Oh, that bad. Yeah, no, I don't know. It, I feel like it's 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 too much or something. Let me try another one. Um, I'll describe the taste to you better. Mm. I know what it is. Mm, 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 mm. The texture is very much okay. The flavor is very much okay. Their only problem is, you know when you eat Cheetos and like the moment you put it in your mouth for the first time, you have this like, or something of like cheese. Um, oh, my fucking jaw hurt. I don't know, that hurt my jaw. Um, it's like the cheese, the air in your mouth tastes like cheese. I don't know how to describe it. It's like there is there is a there's a fragrance to it and it's you can kind of feel it in your mouth. It's like the yeah 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 the cheese air that you have when you bite into it. And it's it only hits you like the first second that you put in your mouth and then it just kind of it's kind of like a cheese breath thing that you that you have. Though that cheese breath combined with the peanut butter taste is really nasty, I think. <laughs> it tastes it tastes really fucking nasty. It literally tastes what I imagine a fart would taste like if you would eat it, if you could eat it. Um, <laughs> no cheese breathing technique. <laughs> I don't know, I don't like it. I, I don't like it. I think this is a three out of 10, actually. It's a three out of 10. It, no, I don't know. <laughs> Um, I ate two. I did it for you. Um, a cheese puff with PB is four. What was it? Three, three out of ten. Did I say three or four out of ten? Three out of ten was it? Three, three out of ten. It was just not good. <laughs> it was not good. I don't know. This was, this is the worst one so far. And I have the feeling most of the ones with peanut butter are going to be, which is why we should continue with the next peanut butter one. Um, the next peanut butter one is going to be. <sighs> ah, okay. Da, 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 da. Blah. Nani kure! Pickle this. It is pickle this. It is the pickle. It is the pickle. Look at it. <laughs> Look at it. It's been sliced like that. Did you know pickles over here are really sweet and sour? And I found it really weird that when I bought an American brand of pickles before, it was salty. That was so weird to me. You guys have salty pickles. That is crazy. I like the sweet and sour much better. I think our pickles are actually better. This is a sweet and sour pickle. This is not a salty pickle. I am... I don't, I don't know. The salty pickles are meh. Mm. I didn't know about it. I, it, I don't know. It's... Aren't all pickles? No! This is sweet and sour! It's it's very sweet and sour. We don't have like briny, salty, salty pickles. That's not common here. It's sweet and it's good. It's, it's actually really good. I mean, the one in like a McDonald's burger is also sweet and sour. It's not a salty pickle. But I remember buying like an American pot of pickles. It was so salty. It was so weird. I was also weird uh, because I know some people they use pickle juice to fry their chicken. Like to, like, they marinate it in the pickle juice or something and they fry their chicken in it. And, um, to me that seemed kind of weird because I was like, damn, there's like so much sugar in it. That's gonna, that's gonna burn up. Um, 
No. It's salty pickle. Salty. Pickles are salty by default. Well, actually, actually. Actually, pickle is a form of preparation rather than um, one singular um, thing. So, um, there is sweet pickles, there is salty pickles, they're all correct. Okay, so. <laughs> it's just a different kind of pickle. It's the same how people think that like this vegetable is the pickle. No, this is just some sort of cucumber. There is other kind of pickles as well. Like you could consider capers pickles as well because they are pickled. Actually. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Fuck off, don't call me nerd. You're a fucking nerd. I've I've been doing it so much that like it just broke. I played it with it too much. Um, okay. So let's have that final peanut butter on it. Oh yeah. Okay. It doesn't even stick to it. Jesus. <laughs> I like how I like did that. <laughs> Didn't even stick to it. Ah, oh, fucking nasty. Key there. Key there. Mmm. Mmm. Ah. I feel like this is going to be absolutely nasty. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be the worst one. All right. I just joined, what the fuck is that? It's a pickle with peanut butter, with crunchy peanut butter on it. All right. Itadakimasu. Ah. Okay, that, that was fucking weird. Um. That is weird. Okay, something weird just happened there. So usually I find that whenever I eat something together with peanut butter, the peanut butter always, always overpowers the other flavor. In this case, I barely tasted the peanut butter at all. I could feel the texture of the peanut butter and the crunchy bits and like that, that nutty spread, whatever the fuck you probably call it. I could feel that, but the pickle flavor just overpowered everything. Everything. So it just tasted like pickle. <laughs> it just tasted like pickle. And that was... I don't know. The crunchy bits weren't really like disgusting or something either. It was just an extra texture. Like I, I know it's nuts. So like it's, it's fine. Mm. Because the pickle was on your tongue. I actually turned it around when I ate it. So the pickle would... Oh, sorry, the, the, what is it? Peanut butter would be on my tongue. It was still barely any peanut butter taste. Just pickle. Just pickle. By the way, please tell me when I mess it up. Um, this is pickle with peanut butter. Mm. <laughs> no, it's fine. I just for gore. Um, <laughs> ignore that. <laughs> Shut up. I'd say it's a five out of, no, a six out of 10 because it's just pickle. I thought the pickle on its own was a little, um, little, <sighs> it's so strong, I don't know. I like those smaller pickles better. Do you know which one I'm, I mean? The ones shaped like this. The one with the shape like this and you can like, you know. That one, not the slice one. I actually don't really like these pickles better. I, I think I bought this for like one specific recipe that I um, wanted to do and like I regret buying these. They're not too good, they're too strong. Um, six, six out of 10, six out of 10. This is just a solid six out of 10. Um, the small pickles are so much better. Way, 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 way better. Gherkins, gherkins. Is it the Gherkins? That is the sp that's a specific name of it. Still pickle. Pikuru. Um. All right, let's see, let's see. What should we do next? Gherkins actually sounds almost the same how we call it. In Dutch, we call it Alhurk. Al uh, Alhurk. Hurk is like, it so it's like, sounds like Gherkin. <laughs> I don't know. Alhurka, Gherkin. 
It's very, very similar. Mm. It's kind of cute, don't you think? <laughs> it's not called Gherkin. I'll hurt. Um, let's see. Next one, next one. Okay, so the next one is a very interesting one, which I want to do. And it's also with peanut butter, so we're not done with the peanut butter yet. And it's a sandwich. And this sandwich is called the Elvis sandwich because apparently Elvis liked this sandwich. <sighs> it's the bread. I have brown bread because it fills me up better and it's healthier. Um, I don't wanna make like a big one, so I'm just gonna make like, I'm gonna cut it in half and like make a small sandwich. So what goes on the sandwich is the first ingredient. Peanut butter. Let's start with the peanut butter so we can spread it nicely. There you go. Peanut butter. What's all this peanut butter? It's just peanut butter is very hit or miss with these weird food combos. The second one. Second ingredient is. This. This thing. Banana. <laughs> it's a banana. And for some reason I can't fucking open this banana. Oh my god. Okay. I know why. I went to the store and they only had unripe bananas. So annoying. There's like this tiny black butt. Look at this. Let's take that off. Fuck that. Alright. Banana. I'm gonna cut the banana. <laughs> Just cutting the banana, don't worry. <laughs> there you go. Nice banana slices. All nice and slimy. Hmm. There you go. Now this sounds pretty good. But the last ingredient though, which I saw that they did is da 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 Bacon <laughs> Bacon time I'm gonna put bacon on it. Nice. It, it is cooked. It is fried. It, this was pre-fried. The pre-fried bacon at the store was actually cheaper than the raw one. So I went for this one instead. And it was gonna sit there anyway. So it was not gonna be crispy anymore. There you go. The Elvis special. <laughs> This is the Elvish, Elvis, not Elvish, Elvis, <laughs> the Elvish Elvis sandwich. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think this is going to taste like? What do you think? Hmm, is it gonna be good? Elvis, <laughs> Elvis bread. <laughs> it is Elvis bread. Look at it, look at it. Wow, Legolas favorite. <laughs> a real favorite king. Ew. Elvis the king. Let's go. Luis, thank you so much. Best so far, surely. Let's check it out. I'm curious. I mean, this was someone's favorite, so it gotta be good. Let's take a bite, okay? <laughs> Itadakimasu! Mm. 
I'm so chewy. No, it's just my jaw. It's, it's kind of hard to chew. Mm. Okay, my first verdict is that there should be more bacon. Let's try it again. Oh, so hard to chew with my jaw. Sorry. It's been like this for months. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna eat the whole thing because it's actually quite filling, which I was kind of expecting. Um, Elvis was onto something right here because this is actually pretty good. <laughs> It's weird because you take these ingredients that are completely different from each other. You have the peanut butter, um, banana, and um, uh, the bacon. It's actually pretty good. I think especially that banana and that bacon, it goes really well together. It Thank kind you. of reminds me of bacon pancakes. Um, <laughs> I'm going to just put there to make Elvis noise. No, I'm, I'm dancing like him right now. I'm doing that little like leg thing that he always does. And I'm doing the lip thing that he always does. You know, where he like like lifts. I can do that actually. I can do that lip thing that always does. It, do it doesn't show, but I can do that. <laughs> where he lifts up his lip on, on one side. <laughs> it's making me do that. Mm. Been busy, so I'm able to send one cheese. Wait, cheese with apples. Che oh God. I'm not sure if I still have cheese. Mm. This is good. It's really, really good. I do think the peanut butter doesn't come forward as much, but from what I do taste, it's it's nice and I feel like it does tie, uh, tie together a little bit more. Um, I would rate this a... Mm, this is hard. Eight or, eight or nine out of 10. Um, let's say eight out of 10. I say this is an eight out of 10. Eight out of 10, nine. Um, <clears throat> it's really good. The only thing is, I, I think I don't think I could eat a lot of this because this is this is heavy, man. Like I, I feel full by just having like two bites of that. That is, it's really really heavy. That good. It's actually really tasty. It's really really tasty. Like I I would I consider this very good for what it is. Mm, it's a legit meal. It actually feels like a good meal. It doesn't feel like a snack. It's good, but it's so 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 heavy. Um. Also, the bacon kind of slides off. The banana is really slippery. I would suggest you try this, actually. I suggest you try this. It's really, it's really good. You see why he didn't lift? I thought that was because of the fast food and stuff. <laughs> Just like Elvis. Yeah, it's one for the money, two for the show. Three to get ready now. Go, cat, go, but don't you step Thank on my you. blue suede shoes. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Ah, there's bacon stuck between my teeth. That's kind of annoying. Mm. All right. So we have Elvis sandwich. <laughs> I want to type Elvis bread because I can. <laughs> bread, um, eight out of 10. Elvis bread, let's go. Elvis bread is good. Okay, let's see. Next one is um, apple and mayonnaise. <laughs> Elvis Bradley. <laughs> apple and mayonnaise. Let's go. So, I'll just. Ooh, this is a juicy apple. It's an L Star apple. Oh, it's fucking juicy. Look at that. Weep. Cut it out. So, I got an apple slice. 
and then I take some Helma mayonnaise because this is the only mayonnaise I have left. And I don't actually like this mayonnaise too much. I think Dutch mayonnaise is so much better. Belgian. All right. Mayo is nasty by itself. I like mayo. Put it on. Put it on. Mwah. Nice. I'll call it a mayo. <laughs> I'll, there's a lot of people who don't like mayo. Ha. Huh? I see. Ah, I got it all over my fingers. It's okay. It's all right. I like Japanese mayo a lot, though. All right. Itadakimasu. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, that's weird. What? No. It's really good. <laughs> it's really, really good. Texture wise, it's really fucking good. You have the crunchy apple and then the kind of like decadent like mayo. And then it's slightly salty. Slightly salty. And then you have like the sweetness from the apple. And I feel like the mayo is, is a, it's a bit oily or something, but the apple kind of cuts through it. This is actually really fucking good. What the fuck? I really like this. This, this is actually like a, a legitimate nice snack. I could, I could snack on this. Is good. It's, it's especially good for people like me. I like I don't like sweet. So what happens here is you have that sweetness, but it kind of gets, you know, by the salt of like the um, mayo, it kind of gets cut. It's it's pretty good actually. Apples tend to be good with fatty foods. Yeah, no, it's it's totally good. It totally fits. It totally fits. Had some apple and mayo around me. Seems mid to. I think it's pretty good. I wonder what kind of apple you have though. Maybe I don't know. Maybe it's also because. It, it tastes kind of familiar to me um, So me and my sister have this thing Where if we make tuna mayo uh, Like, uh, what is it? Tuna, tuna salad Tuna mayo salad for, for on a bread We actually Cut up a little bit of apple And then like put it in I actually came up with that But she stole the idea And she took all the credit um, <laughs> it's, it's really good You'd be surprised. Don't say, gr I swear, try it. You don't want to put in too much. You slice it very, in like very small, very small blocks. And then you put it in, you, in your tuna mayo. It's really, really, really good. No, no, you don't put it on the fruit. You put the fruit in it, like tiny bits of fruit. And then you put it on the sandwich. You put it on the sandwich. Trust me, like if you like a sweet and sour combination, you'll like this. If you're not into that, then no, you won't like this. It tastes, I don't know, like the te texture-wise, if you cut it very small into very small cubes. You put it on your uh, sandwich with the tuna mayo. Um, it tastes like, like you get that same texture that you have with like raw onion when you chop it small. Except it's slightly sweeter. And you have less of that onion, that raw onion taste to it. Which I personally, I don't really like that too much. It's pretty good. Put it in a rocket ro recipe book. No! <laughs> <laughs> Why would I put that? It's my secret recipe. Look, it's a it's a Pac-Man. It's Pac-Man. Thank you. Pac-Man. Yo, I totally forgot to send it, but what about a shrimp between Oreo biscuits? I have shrimp in my freezer. I could fry them up if you guys have patience. <laughs> Alright, so... Um, I didn't even write it, damn it. Apple, uh, and mayo. What is it? Apple and mayo. I will rate this. Eight. Eight out of ten as well. Pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Time to make apple flavored mayo. <laughs> Why not breed a mayo flavored apple, huh? That sounds like more of a challenge. They already have cotton candy grapes, so... Um, let's see, okay, next one is... Ah. 
<laughs> Doritos! Sorry, it's a broken Dorito. Because apparently all of them are broken in this bag. Damn it. Um, this is nacho cheese. Doritos. With. Da, 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 da. What do you think it's going to be? What do you think it's going to be? Wow! You know what this is? Nutella! <laughs> Nutella! Chocolate! <laughs> Chocolate! <laughs> is this gonna be good? I think it's gonna be fucking terrible. I have a feeling it's gonna be absolutely terrible. It's gonna be nasty. Things with chocolate, it's fucking horrible. I remember when I made my donuts on pizza, every ingredient on that tasted all right, except for the one, except for the Nutella bits. The Nutella bits were like the grossest. They were absolutely terrible. Oh my God. Ah, okay, let me clean my knife. Yeah, no, I don't like chocolate to begin with. This is why this pot is probably expired. <laughs> it's, it's been here for a while. It's been here for a while. I... That's why it's also like, it looks like that. <laughs> I don't want to check the date, okay? I, I don't often eat Nutella. I, I sometimes eat it with... Um, like pancakes or something. But I rarely make pancakes. That's why... <laughs> Let me check the date. Okay, and if it's bad, I'm not gonna say. Where's the expiry date even? Dude, there is not even an expiry date on it. That means that it can last forever. Right? <laughs> I swear, there's no expiry date on this. Oh my god, okay. There's just no freaking expiry date. There. Whatever. It, so it lasts forever. So it's fine. So it's fine. The fact that it's been here for probably like three years is fine. It's not on the cap eater. No expiry date. Oh, I see. <laughs> that, that's how old it is. <laughs> okay. I <laughs> I told you, I don't like chocolate, so it's been there for a while. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Daijou boot. I mean, now it's getting eaten, so that's good. I'm gonna make it nice. Nice! There you go. This looks nasty. It looks absolutely nasty! <laughs> This looks so nasty. Ah! I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. This is... <clears throat> Dorito with Nutella. It's fucking disgusting. Let's try it out, okay? Here goes nothing. Ah... Uh... Oh my god. Oh my god. Ugh. Blech. I don't like that. <laughs> that was not good at all. That was really not good. No. No, no, no. No. The Nutella just completely overpowers the Dorito. Except you still have like the cheese whiff that I, I told you about with the cheese puffs. It's just not good at all. I would rate this maybe like a four, a four out of 10. It's better, it's still better than the cheese puff with, with a peanut butter. But this is like, uh, it's just, it's just weird. It's just really weird. I feel like people who like to eat like fries with vanilla ice cream or something like this 
But I, I don't I don't like that actually. So I, I don't like this. There's too much sweet. Way too much sweet. Try to bring Oreo and cream cheese. It was part of a Oreo truffle recipe, but I was too late to prepare it, so I skipped the last part of the recipe. I don't have Oreos with me. Maybe I can try it next time. Thank you so much for the suggestion though, cringe coon. Erica, how's the food crime review going? It's it's terrible. I had like here, Dorito with Shit, I guess. <laughs> With Nutella. But I don't like chocolate, so you know I'm not gonna like it. Why are you making satisfying sounds while, while eating? <laughs> I see. I'm not used to hearing someone being uh, satisfied, I see. <laughs> Can't distinguish disgust from someone enjoying, hmm? <laughs> I see, I see. I see how it is. I see. Those were not satisfying sounds. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if she did that, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to break it to you, but I don't think she was enjoying it. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry that you have to find out this way. <laughs> Alrighty, the ducky was. I put less chocolate on that one. And it was better, but still not good. No. No. It stays on the same score. It's a four. It's a four. It's not good. No, 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 no. No good, no good, no good. <sighs> well, the worst one yet. Mm hmm. <laughs> Three totally comes after four, Bell. <laughs> All right. Um, next one is going to be. Um. Okay. <sighs> So for this one, I need to go to the kitchen because I I think the food crows are making you lost out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, is this what this food does to me? I wonder where where did the hostility start? Which of these foods made me host? I think it's the Elvis bread. Once I had the Elvis bread, it was over for all of these. <laughs> and then became evil. Like, think about it, like, Elvis, if you, like, change the letters up, it could spell evil with an extra S. Like, and then the S stands for super. Like, super evil. So it's just El- <laughs> So it's just super evil. Super evil, Brad. Yeah. <laughs> it could spell lives. Yes, but those are details. We're talking about evil right now. <laughs> <laughs> Evil's bread. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> evil, evil S reg. S reg evil. Evil bread. Yeah. <laughs> Weevil bread. Super every villainous is <laughs> lemons. <laughs> like, <laughs> evil is life backwards. Unbelievable. I can't believe. Okay, no, I need to go to uh, my kitchen to get it from the freezer um, because it's ice cream. We're gonna do some ice cream combinations. And I'm very excited about this one because these are some really weird ones. So, be right back. Be right back. I'm gonna get it. Have fun with the words. <laughs> I'll let you play. I'll let you play, like, what is it? Words on screen next time if you like this. <laughs> I'll get it for you during the waiting screen or something. Ah. Okay, so I 
don't eat ice cream at home. Whenever I eat ice, oh, by the way, I'm back. Um, but whenever I eat ice cream, I usually get like popsicles from the store. She is Chuber. Yes, I am Chuber. I'm Chuber, you're right. Um, but okay. No, no, no. Whenever, whenever I, I, I want ice cream, I usually go for popsicles. I like popsicles a lot. Um, did you bump into something? No, my freezer is just really fucking full, so it was hard to open. <laughs> Hello, Chuber. <laughs> You're just gonna call me Chuber. Um, but like, I, I don't really like other kind of ice cream too much, so I don't really eat that, eat it that often. I didn't even close my Nutella. Like, and I went to get ice cream, like vanilla ice cream for this, um, specifically, for the stream specifically. So it's like a new box of vanilla ice cream. Look, as if you haven't ever seen it. <laughs> it's like completely clean. I've, I've never eaten this. I just, I just never eat ice cream, man. I don't even have like a special spoon for ice cream like some people usually do. So, I got vanilla ice cream because that's what it said. It said vanilla ice cream. You like popsicles? I got a, a whole freezer full of popsicles. Oh! Is it, is it in that cool van you brought with you? That does sound like an attractive offer you're making right there. Oh. Little ice. Ice. Plum. A little bit of ice because we're gonna do multiple ones. All right, I hope it doesn't melt. I hope I don't take too long. But the first combination we're going to do is a combination recommended by my gen mate, Pony Confetti. And she told me to put Italian croutons, which these were more expensive. I don't even know why. Italian croutons on top of vanilla ice cream. So it's going to be Vanilla ice with Italian croutons. There you go. This one sounded legit. It actually sounded really good. So I am. I have high hopes for this. I have really high hopes for this. So I'm gonna put them on. How much were they for? Like for a bag like this, which it's not even that big. Like look at my hand. It's like a tiny bag. This was like four euro. That's fucking crazy. That's ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> they don't really stick to the ice cream, but it's probably because I don't really have that. But this is like a singular one that did stick. It's like only one. <laughs> Alright. So now, we got a good spoon. Fork. No, I'm gonna stir it. I'm gonna like get it, get it on a little bit. It's okay. I'll, I'll, I'll get some with the bite. I'll get some with the bite. So I'll take uh, a little bit of ice. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> there we go. Vanilla ice with Italian croutons. Is this going to be good or not? It sounded really good. This, this uh, Italian crouton even came with like dried tomato pieces. So, let's go. Itadakimasu. Thank you. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, I think this is the best one yet. This is really fucking good. <laughs> what the hell? Chris can try hot oatmeal with vanilla ice cream sometime. Hot oatmeal with vanilla ice cream. I'll try it. That sounds pretty good too. You ever tried fried ice cream? It's pretty good. I've never tried fried ice cream. I've been wanting to try it, but it's always pretty expensive when they sell it. And I'm not too big of an ice lover to like go all the way and make it myself. No, no, this is, this is pretty good. This is really good actually. I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Mm. Mm. 
There's like the slight saltiness from the croutons. Goes really well with the eyes. And surprisingly, the Italian seasonings are pretty nice with it as well. This is really, really, she's, okay, Connie was not joking. I, I legitimately think she tried this before. She knew what she was doing. Mmm. It's good. I'd say it's an eight and a half out of ten. Mm. Very good. Very nice. Well, I can type. Thank you. Mm. All right. Really good. Okay, next one is going to be. Mm, also ice cream. We have more ice cream combos. Ice cream with hot chocolate. Oh, I don't have hot chocolate. I don't often drink chocolate milk because I don't like chocolate. Maybe I can try it next time. Yeah! Okay, I love that ice cream is frozen because the, the, the whole ice cream box, because of my room, is so full. Um, the little ice cream box just fell on the floor upside down and I was like, shit, the ice cream foil. But, um... No, it's, it's fine. I have carpet, so I was really worried. <laughs> I, have, I, I hate carpet in my house, but I have carpet in my um, in my computer room because it helps with um, with the acoustics. No, but it's fine, it's fine. All right, ice cream number two is going to be ice cream with, what do you think? Ice cream with, salt is good for spills on carpet. Ooh, I'll keep that in mind. Soy sauce. Kikoman. Kikoman soy sauce. Let's go. So this is a combination which I found online. And people say that this is supposed to be really good. Um, I am curious, okay? I'm curious. Because people say it's actually really, this is really good. It's supposed to be good. I, I don't know. <laughs> It doesn't sound terrible. I don't think it sounds super terrible. It just sounds very surprising. But let me just put a little bit of soy sauce on it. A little bit of soy sauce on it. <laughs> like that. I'm very curious, okay? All right. Me as an Asian want to prove what if it's actually good? Then you then you will take credit. <laughs> All right. Here we go. So I got the soy sauce on it. Here goes nothing. Um. Um. Hmm. It's good, but it's it's not as good as I thought it would be. So, it doesn't really mix that well. It does it make it a bit salty. I kind of like that it makes it a bit salty, but... Um, it's very mid. Mm. Now, you really want the ice cream to be, like, coated in the soy sauce. You don't want to have any like loose soy sauce, kind of like that. You kind of want to stir it up like a little bit. Stir it up a little bit. This is actually pretty good. Do this and then tell someone it's chocolate ice cream. <laughs> now it looks like poop. You should see a doctor if your poop looks like this, sir. Because that, that's kind of wide. It's pretty good, but I do think I added a bit too much soy sauce. I think it could do it even less. 
It could do it even less. Mm. And now the last one. Oh wait, I didn't. I forgot. I forgot to fucking give it a, give it a score. Damn it. Um, the eyes with soy sauce. Um, this is. Not like with soy sauce. Um, I'd say it's a six out of six out of ten. It's a six. It's very. It's pretty good. But nah, it could be better. All right. Next one. Last one. This was also one I found online. Which people said was supposed to be good. And you guys are gonna hate this. I just know. I just know you guys are gonna hate this. So, this is vanilla ice cream with. Da 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 da! Olive oil! Vanilla ice cream with olive oil. So, <laughs> I'm not sure what this is gonna be like. No, <laughs> yeah, time to get oiled up. It's gonna be okay. Okay, <laughs> people say this is good. Okay, I'm not sure if they lied to me though, but like, but I'm gonna put on a little bit. Okay, I'm putting on a little bit. It looks fancy. I give it that. It looks very fancy. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. The way how it's drizzled on looks very fancy to me. I don't know what it is. It, okay. A little bit of olive oil. Alright. Let's go. It looks like caramel. It, it it doesn't. It looks green. It looks like yellow on the screen, but it's 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 more green in in real life. It's more green in real life. All right. Itadakimasu. Here goes nothing. Mmm. Wow. Really good. <laughs> that one is really fucking good. What the fuck? What? I'm for real. I'm for real. It's really, really good, and you wouldn't expect it at all. At all. It's not bad, cause okay, the olive oil. It's just oil. So it, all, all you get is you get that like olive oil, like kind of almost floral tasting um, aspect of the olive oil with the. Vanilla ice cream. It's very mild. It is very mild, but um, it's really, really good. It does not taste oily at all. You guys are overreacting. Okay, like there is already oil in ice cream. Whether you want to believe it or not. It's already there. The only difference is that it's already mixed in. It's not like you're introducing a totally new ingredient into it. There's already fat in it. There's fat in ice cream. It's really fucking good. <laughs> What? My town made straight up olive oil ice cream as an experiment and wasn't even too bad. It was, it's not too bad. It's pretty good. But animal fat is a bit different. It comes down to the same thing. Like, taste-wise, this is just really good. You, you actually have a bit of a floral taste. It's like vanilla ice cream with a slightly floral taste. It's nothing, like, completely different. Like, it still tastes like vanilla ice cream. But with that floral olive oil taste to it, it's, it's just so good. Mm. I recommend this one. If you like vanilla ice cream, and if you're not repulsed by like olive oil, you will like this. Trust me, it's really good. Really, really, really good. This one is a nine out of 10. Very, very tasty. Very tasty. I keep messing up. This was the olive oil. <laughs> ah. 
Vanilla eyes with Why? Olive oil is a nine out of ten. This is the best I've had so far. It actually it tastes very um gourmet. <laughs> it's some fucking gourmet food right there. Okay? It actually tastes more gourmet like this is a cheap as fuck vanilla ice cream. Like you could see it didn't even have vanilla beans in it. And um it's some gourmet shit. Yeah. It's some real fucking gourmet shit. It's so good. <laughs> I'm surprised. You don't want to put on too much olive oil. It's very very overpowering and can get a little bitter if you put on too much. Put on a little bit, like just a little bit, just ever so slightly. It's really really good. Mm. No, 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 it's it's really really good. Very nice. Nine of ten. All right. Let's see what else do we have. Oh, another one. I also need to get this one in my kitchen because I didn't want it to melt. The next one is going to be. Uh, one which I'm actually scared of <laughs> And it's going to be the last one of tonight because um, Else my tummy is going to get really upset <laughs> I think So let me just get the ingredients for the for the last one, okay? Be right back Be right back back and got my stuff it's two ingredients combined two ingredients combined and it's gonna give me a fucking heart attack if i die on the stream it's this what this one's gonna kill me this one is going to be butter and sugar it's gonna be a whole block of butter Dipped in sugar. And it scares me. <laughs> and to make things okay, to make things alright, I'll use my super cute Shinobu. <laughs> Shinobu plate that I finally fucking found. After so many fucking years, this was lost and I found it again. I'm so happy. <sighs> Shinobu plate, please. Make me not die, okay? Please, make me not die. <laughs> it's really cute. I'm so... So proud of that plate. If it was a bit of butter, then it wouldn't be a problem. It's gonna be like a bite of butter. Okay, so there's a sugar. All right. I'm not gonna do the entire stick of butter. I have a, a a block of butter, and but I'm just gonna put the whole thing or half maybe in my mouth. Oh shit! I already cut this one up. Okay, it's going to be a blob of butter, but it's still a lot. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> okay, is this butter? I think I cooked with the half with half, and I just put it back. Okay, there you go, butter. Butter. I'm not gonna do more. I think I will literally die. It sounds fucking bad. I'm sorry, but this is like... <sighs> I'm... <sighs> gonna get a fucking heart attack. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm sc uh, I remember being at a friend's house um, when I was younger. I think I was like... Maybe four years old. Four or five years old. And I went to my friend's house to play over at her place. And she had a little brother. And um, I was staying over. And then in the morning, we were um, 
eating breakfast. We were eating breakfast, and then、um, her little brother kept grabbing the butter and then putting like his entire finger in it, and like just getting all the butter like that, and then just licking it off his finger or something like that. And、um, I remember him doing that all the time. And then at some point,、um, my friend said, "Oh my God, he is—he he keeps eating the butter or something." And then her mom turned around, and she started yelling like, "Don't eat that butter, else you'll fucking die!" or something. Like she really like fucking got to him, and she she got so fucking mad just over the fact that he was eating the butter.、Um, and then、um, she was like, she t- she kept telling him like. That he was gonna get a heart attack and die if he did that. So was it? Like, no, I was four years old, and I don't know. After she said that, I was like, "Shit, she's for real," you know. So I, I was like, "Shit!" Like, I'm, I legit believe that I would die if I ate too much butter. Isn't that just the thing you you say to scare your kids? Well, <laughs> I fucking believed it when she said that. She said he was gonna get a heart attack and die. So I, I believed if I eat too much butter at once, I'll get a heart attack and die. So <laughs> I don't know that. I know it's probably not true. There's a lot of butter and stuff in a lot of foods, but it's I don't know that. Memory still stay with me. It was kind of scary. <laughs> she got she lashed out, and it was scary because she was usually the type of mom who like would be really kind, and all of a sudden she just lashed out at him for that. Crazy. What if it's true though? Well, then this is the final stream, I guess. <laughs> All right, I got it in butter. In butter, I mean in sugar. Okay, there you go. It's coated in sugar. It's coated in sugar. All right. <laughs> Shall we go? Please remember me. And please. Worship me, okay? Cause I died for your sins. Cause you suggested this. Itadakimas, and goodbye. Thank you. Oh my God. We are gathered here today in fond memory of our Oshi, Rocker Orin. She died as she lived, a brat. Thank you. Oh my god! <coughs> I need to drink something. Give me that fucking OJ, man. I need some fucking acid. <sighs> I'm trying, really, trying really hard not to, not to gag. Holy fuck! Okay, that is nasty. That is fucking nasty. You know what it is? The flavors are fine. It's the texture. What the fuck? Why would you eat that? That is so bad. Oh my god. Ah. The texture is fucking awful. It is fucking awful. It's literally just biting into butter. It leaves a film in your mouth, and like, it's like all oily and like it melts, but it, it, it's like melts in your mouth, but like in like a in like a fucking terrible way. That was so bad. What the fuck? I no, I hate that. I was I was legitimately trying not to throw up. This is a one out of ten for me. This yeah, or maybe um, I'd say a two out of ten because it wasn't able to to make me throw up instantly. I could still hold it in. This is a two out of ten. Um, fucking bad. Holy fuck, that was the worst one of today. That was the worst. What is zero? There's no zero. It's 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 one to ten. 
Um, one would be like something that that just instantly makes me like puke. Two is like I want to puke, but I can't. I can still try to hold it in. Ugh, that's so fucking gross. I I hate that. Ah, Shinobu, I'm sorry. Shinobu, I love this blade so much. I wish I had a whole set of these blades. I'm so sad. Like I won this at a lottery. Um, and I, th this was the only one which they had. Like, I want to have more. I want to have Shinobu big plates. I want to have Shinobu mugs. I, I want it. What Shinobu is this? You don't know? You can't tell? Look at the hair. Look at the hair. Okay, wait. Just, um, let me just put this here or whatever. Um, here, do you know now? It's the Shinobu! <laughs> you know now! <laughs> you don't know! Okay. Um. Monogatari series! Shinobu. It's from Monogatari. <laughs> they. Oh my god, Demon Slayer. <laughs> Don't tell me! Demon Slayer's taking over Monogatari! Ah! I'm not a fan of Demon Slayer, actually. Ah! I am disappointed. <laughs> yeah, it is. She is a thousand years old. She is a thousand years old. She is a vampire. And she is really, really cute. She's one of my favorite characters. The fuck? Oh, okay. Well, my battery is almost dead as well, so... <laughs> so the camera's just gonna die at some point. She's totally legal. She is a thousand years old, so that is... that is legal. Okay, that is very legal. Her age matters. Hmm. So not my favorite character. She's my... Wife? But you didn't even recognize your own life, so like... <laughs> I don't know about I don't know about you, man, but I don't I don't think so. Oh no, Roka, she's minor coded. Yeah, well, pff, wait until you're gonna find out how short I am. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Yeah, newsflash: short girls exist, and that's just our height, and that's just how it is. Okay. And it has nothing to do with children! Okay? <laughs> I swear, every single fucking time I hear minor coded, I wanna fucking choke someone! I fucking hate it! I'm born short! I'm born to be short! My parents are short, I turn out short! My mom is baby faced, I turn out baby faced! Okay? So, if I hear one thing about Minor Coda, I will come to you and I'll beat you up! Cause what the fuck?! I hate it. I fucking hate people who do that, okay? I fucking hate people who do that. Like, I am more than legal! I am a grown fucking woman. And I did not choose to be like this, okay? Don't be mad because you already look 60 years old when you're 18! That's your problem! Okay? She have no skincare. Jesus fucking thank Christ. <sighs> well, anyway, thank you to <laughs> for today. I'm sorry, it's the Nutella. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's it's the Nutella. This is what Nutella does to me. This is why you should never give me fucking chocolate, man. It, it's like. You know, it's it's like me being like baby was like give me chocolate, and then I I, I eat it and <sighs> I just go crazy. <laughs> That's why the expiration date is gone. <laughs> well, genetic winner in my opinion, but everyone should like themselves. Wait, what do you mean winner? Hmm. There isn't much for everyone. Some people like. Cute girls like me. And some people like grandmas. And that's completely <laughs> fine. <laughs> that's completely fine. It's it's cool. It's okay. You don't have to hate on me. 
because you look like a grandma already, okay? So, <laughs> there's no in between. No, there's no in between. There's only there's only cute girls and grandmas. <laughs> Assuming you're not both. Well, actually, <laughs> actually, I wonder how long I'll stay babyface. If like at one eight at one point like one H I hit. Um, I'm gonna eat this piece of bacon because it's laying here. Ah, uh, at one point, I'll just turn like gr full grandma. At what age does my face turn grandma? Hmm. Yes, Lily Baba. So what? Hmm. So what? Ah. All right. All right. Let's wrap up. Let's wrap up. Thank you. Let's see who we can read. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, let's read. Thank you. This is my friend. Her name is Serena. And she is an amazing vocalist. Thank you. She is doing a 21K drunk karaoke celebration right now. So please give her support and please listen to her sing. She is insanely good at singing. So if you like good singers, do check her out. Um, thank you so much for today. Thank you so much for enjoying me. Shinobu also says thank you. She also says thank you. She loves you. And um, enjoy the rest of your night, day, whatever it is. And I will not see you tomorrow because tomorrow I will be at work. But the day after, I'll be back with some drawing. Um, and I'll see you right there because I'm excited for that. Now I'm going to draw you. Wait, wait. You. This is directed at you. I'm going to draw you. So be there because else I don't have an example to draw. I need to look at you while I'm drawing you. So you need to be there or be square. Okay. So bye bye. Thank you so much for today. Otsuka on in and wait. Oh, fuck. Mwah! Wait, wait, I want to do that, the thingy thing. Mwah. Wait, can't I just... Okay, wait, how about this? Here. I can't do it, but... I'm kidding, I'm, okay, I'm kissing my finger. Mwah. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Mwah. Bye. <laughs>